In March of 2021, Broward County Public Schools sponsored the third annual Broward Youth Climate Summit. Created by the Broward Youth Climate Task Force, this summit provided a platform for students in grades 5 through 12 to not only learn about climate change, but how their voices can push for climate policy change. For three sessions, students shared their knowledge with each other and got to hear from experts in the field. In a special Cosmic Queries episode of Star Talk, keynote speakers included renowned astrophysicist Dr. Neil deGrasse Tyson, comedian Chuck Nice, and climatologist Dr. Gavin Schmidt. This is Star Talk, Cosmic Queries edition, special live at the Broward County Youth Climate Summit. They accepted questions from students, ranging from who first discovered global warming to what will happen if we do nothing about it. What can we do as kids to slow down the global warming process? You can encourage you know, local recycling. You can encourage uh, renewable energy. You can encourage your school to, uh, to have a, you know, a zero waste cafeteria. All of these things are good uh, and positive steps. You have social and cultural power. Because if you're, if you're 12 years old and you write a letter to the editor of the local paper that you're concerned, I bet they're gonna publish it. And so you can have influence beyond title because, because when, if, if the 10 year olds start worrying about how the adults are messing up the environment, that's something to take notice of. Comedian Chuck Nice provided some needed levity for such a serious subject. What kind of jobs are there for people interested in climate and climate studies? Sierra, I don't, let me just say Sierra, I'm already proud of you, okay? You're not only <laughs> looking to solve the existential crisis that faces all of mankind, but you're like, how do I make some money off of this? <laughs> I love you, Sierra, that's the way to think. This year's Climate Summit was totally different because uh, the part where Neil deGrasse Tyson was talking to many of our uh, members who have actually joined us was very informative. It was actually my favorite part. My favorite part of this summit was seeing all the students present uh, on topics, topics that most people don't even know about, and also seeing students like ask questions because it really shows uh, their inner curiosity and them wanting to know how they can contribute back to the community. This is the first time this summit was held virtually, which expanded the number of participants and made the summit more environmentally friendly. It was able to reach more students and it was able to bring in speakers from around the world, right? We had speakers from New York City on Tuesday. We had guest speakers yesterday from the Cayman Islands. The success of this summit shows how these students and staff are dedicated to finding solutions to this serious and pressing issue of climate change.